What's up everyone? It's your boy Polka M coming to you with another unboxing. I hope everyone had a great week and got an opportunity to go out and get some Lost Origin. How is everyone doing today? If this is your first time on my channel, my name is Polka M of PMZ Collect. I'm a collector of sorts and today we're going to be focusing in on something that just came out on the 9th. Pokemon Lost Origin. If you want to go out and get one of these, they retail for $140. Though some people can find them online for a lot cheaper than that. Um, I think eBay has them for about $109. It all depends on the seller. So definitely do make sure that you look at the seller's review. Um, there's a few cool cards in here that I would like to get. I do like the artwork here. It's really cool. Here's a little description of what you might find in Lost Origin. They do name the Garatina V Star here. There's uh, Aerodactyl. There's uh, Magnezone. There's a lot of cool cards in here. Um, there's Machomp. There's Pikachu V Max. Um, there's a Garatina V. That's really cool art. Just really, really cool. Um, and, you know, you're going to see a bunch of prices that are going to pop up on the screen i just want to let you guys know these are prices that um you'll find on tcg player usually those tend to be cheaper than what you'll find on ebay um, ebay is usually regular sellers like myself who spend uh quite a bit on uh this hobby and usually we like to get a fair amount for our cards based on the rarity Sometimes I do feel like TCG player does lowball um, some cards. I think, you know, it all depends on, you know, what someone's willing to pay for any specific card. Um, so as we're doing this first pack magic here, here's the code card. Now, I'm probably not going to show all the code cards. Um, it just it it's a delay every single time to do it. Um, and there's a lot to unpack, uh, and I want to go over a lot. So we have Sligu, Electric, Riley, Bronzer, Snover, Jinx, Inke, Go Wov It, Dust Tox Reverse. And the pull card, or the final card, or the rare card of this pack would be a Clefable non-hollow. I would consider that a bust for first pack magic. Hopefully that doesn't dictate how the rest of the box will be. Hopefully we'll have some pretty cool um, hit cards to look at. Maybe we'll get a secret rare, or maybe we may get... Um, one of the Pikachu uh, uh, rare cards in the set. There's a few of them. So we have Misfortune Sisters, Porygon 2, Lake Aquility, Apom, Fear Narak, Litwick, Roselia, Ruckruck, Mirage Gate Reverse, and we have a Rhyperior Non Hollow. So we are 0 and 2 so far. So if you are here right now watching this for the first time or if you've come before to see some of my videos, please do like and comment. Um, it really does help the channel um, getting some activity and letting uh, letting me know like what you see and if there's anything i can do to improve the content um we have a really can't lost vacuum the rua banaco boomy snover bronzer snover wind up arm first and here we go a magnezone v star nice first hit of the day um, this card right now on TCG Player is going for about a dollar and change. Um, but again, if a card is graded, perfect 10, PSA 10, Beckett 10, um, all of that stuff matters because that's what big time collectors like. They want cards graded already. Um, 
I don't know how many people will actually want a Magnezone V-Star, but it is a nice card to have in the collection and one that we'll keep. So let's go with Hariyama, Arkphone, Medicham, Basculin, Jinx, Makuhita, Slugma, the Fairy, uh, Trevant, Trevavant first, and we have a Dust Tox non hollow. So we have the first and the non hollow version of the Dust Tox. See if we can get another hit here. We did get the Magnezone V Star, which is nice, but not enough yet. I want to get one of the Pikachu character cards or definitely get that Garatina. That Garatina V was so nice. Uh, Box of Disaster, Sligu, Electric again, Phantom, Subudu, Bronzer, Ducklet, Ruckruff. Oh, I see one here. A Pikachu V. What a nice card right there. Check that out. That looks really cool. The Pikachu with the trainer. And that's not even... Oh, Spirit Tomb. Man, it would have been nice if that would have been a hollow right there. It would have been like a hit pack. A double hit pack. But the Pikachu V, I'll take that. That card is almost $25. Non-graded. That's a hit right there. It's about maybe five, six packs in. That is nice. Let's go. All right. Okay. Happy there. Looking at that, this nice Pikachu right here. Very nice. Very cool. So we have Hariyama again. We're starting off with this card. It's like the starter card. Nuzleaf. Turkel. Chelos. Minfu. Leo, Ghastly, my favorite evolution, Gengar is my favorite Pokemon, Ducklet, Seedra Reverse, nice, look at that, nice seed, nice artwork there, and Basca Legion for full hollow, nice, we will take that, um, card is under a dollar, Going for about an, I think 25 cents. So, again, these are TCG player prices. Anything can change. And through time. Time is what, in essence, makes these valuable because they're out of print and people will mess them up. Some people will collect them, some people won't. A lot of people think that due to the big spike during COVID, a lot of people. Are wise and they're keeping all their cards in great condition. Let's speed this pack up a little bit. Two box, big bug, Finian, Gorua, Harris, Inke, Thor in reverse, and the pull card is a Landorus non hollow. As I was saying, um, some people think that a lot, everyone is going. Um, keep like you know certain certain cards in perfect condition sorry i'm like stumbling here i'm like focusing on this opening here i want to make sure that everything is great here all right we have psychic energy for this experiment porygon 2 swana or warm pull dynamo D dot Horsey Riparier. Oh, sorry. Meditite. Then we have the Riparier reverse. Got them both non hollow reverse. And we have a Bufalant non hollow. So a lot of non hollows and reverses here. But that isn't isn't promising. I wouldn't say that's very promising.
Fox of Disaster, Bronze On, My Wild, Jellos, Pinnacle, Porygon. Oh, I see a character right there. That's really cool. Ducklet. Let's go. Parasect and the second car behind it. 86 cent car, not bad. Oh, a Perserker V. Galarian Perserker V. That's a dollar eighty-eight card right there. That is great right there. We have almost a three dollar value right there. That's pretty cool. Wow. Check out that Parasect right there. Look at the artwork on that. Just amazing, man. And 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 this is what gets this is what gets the excited about um you know lost origin is all of these cars that are out there amazing right there that Persecure v looks great and that parasect just that full art that's just amazing all right getting some hits now we're on the up and up over here keep this going Kamala, Thornton, Bronzon, Phantom, Makuki, Makuhita, Electric, Murkrow, Juppet, Rhydon, Reverse, and a Polyrath Non Hollow. Poly, poly wrath to land pretty cool pretty cool have no snowman damage pump the viper Liger, Wormple, Rhyhorn, Murkrow, Horsey, Polyrath Reverse, okay, and a Politoed, nice. I haven't seen a polywag or a polyworld yet, so probably gonna run into a few of those now. I've already seen two polyrafts, so we're due for it. Lost City, Starlink, Finian, Fernarak, Paris, NK, Masculine, Bloom, and a Barbacle. Barbacle, that's nice. 25 cent card, but just look at that artwork. Great. Really like this uh, this set. Like the Pokemon that were selected to complete this set. Hopefully we can get some Machamp, some Machop, Machoke. Pretty cool if we can get that evolution. Or if we can get the Ghastly, the Gengar evolution, that's pretty cool. We got a Ghastly already. We haven't seen a Hunter yet. I'm pretty sure we're going to see either a Hunter or a Gengar. I also like Mimikyu. I would say that Gengar Mimikyu. Gengar is probably my favorite, but well, I, I shouldn't say probably is my favorite for sure. Um, but I like so many Pokemon. There's so many cool Pokemon out there. Mirage Gate, Tascoon, Ambipom, Pikachu. Okay, Pikachu, Phantom, Subwoodoo, Electric. Love this. Have no snowman. And a stone joiner. Non hollow. A lot of non hollows. There's a ton of them. We 
We're gonna do the speed round soon. I'm gonna go through these packs really quick. Mirage Gate. Machoke. Here we go. Pantina. Clefairy. Rosalia. Porygon. Inkay. A lot of Inkays. Blip Bug. Basculine Reverse. So we got the. Uh, the reverse and ba Basque Legion, and then we have the full hollow Basque Legion. Okay. Probably not pronouncing it right, but oh, there we go. Raichu, but non hollow. Non hollow. Green Leaf, Luminian, Machoke, Rosalia, Ruck Ruff, Seal, Chupet, Machop, Parasect, and uh, Cramorant Non Hollow. Fire Energy, Minshao, Lake Aquility, Ian, Hollywag, there we go, Gligar, Boomy, Mawile, Lugma, Bolo, oh, Thornton Trainer Car, nice, $6 hit, let's go, that's really cool right there, leave this up, to make sure that our car stays in great condition. I'm trying to keep everything organized. But you'll what you'll learn watching my videos is that I try to keep all my openings as clean as possible. Um, when I did take my little break um, and was opening up a few cards here and there, something that I wanted to focus in on is making sure that my openings stay clean. I want to make sure that my station here where all the cars are unpacked are somewhat um, organized it's better for you and also for me because um, organizing over you know 250 cards can take up some time definitely so some of the ways that I do it is I usually take care of everything um, that is holographic that stuff gets thrown in the binder right away and then i worry about there we go look at that nice hunter holly whirl luck lickly slugma cliff fairy a palm spear in iraq litwick box of disaster reverse and a hoopa non hollow so yeah, so I would handle pretty much everything that's holographic and then everything else that's not holographic, I would group it up by class of Pokemon. So like, you know, green type, red type, you know, all the different types because the way those are grouped together is the way you would put them in your binder. So it kind of helps out. Um, Arc Phone, Medicham, Misfortune Sisters, Jinx, Litwick, Oddish, Love Disc. Phalanx, Medicham, Prevent, Viva, Vivavent, Vivavent, Full Hollow, and Reverse we had also before. Bloom. Fontina, Gastrom, Phalanx, Poliwag, Oddish, Growlithe, Licky Tongue. Oh, Chandler character, full rare or 
Full hollow. 93 cents, but I'll take it. I will take it. Nice. Look at all these nice, cool character cards that are coming. Really cool. Really cool. We pretty much went through half the booster box already. So we're going to be speeding this up a lot quicker now. Blue box, Gloom, Gastron, SD Seal, Zarua, Nover, Machap, Pikachu, Radiant, Sneasler. Wow, that's nice right there. That is nice, nice right there. Wow, really exciting. Great. And we have the Kyrum V. Wow. Wow. Talk about a hit pack. Let's go. Let's leave this up. Now, even though the Radiant card is not that expensive, I can tell you that Radiant cards out of all the hollows I've seen just have so much work pulled put into them they're just great looking cards they pop out the, the actual character that's in the card pops out the most that is nice we have a lot of hits here that you're seeing on the table and i'm really excited about all of this let's go you've stuck around so far um a lot of this stuff will be up for sale so definitely check out pmzcollect.com and you will definitely see some of this stuff at affordable prices um so definitely go check out the website when you have an opportunity arcanine full hollow wonderful that's what i'm talking about We had the Growlithe and we have the Arcanine. But we completed that evolution. And this is going to be fun packing this stuff up in the binder. It's probably my favorite part in all of this. Of course, spending time with you guys as well, too. This is fun. Always, always unpacking stuff is fun. Gloomy, Metatite. I mean, honestly, it really is. Like, unpacking stuff is just great. Just as much as putting it in. Ooh, Parasect, non hollow. Man, what I have to look into is do some of these non hollows come in hollows? Because if that's the case, which I believe so, because I did get the dust ducks non hollow, non hollow, and then I got it the reverse hollow. So it may come in full hollow, just means that I have more collecting to do and more unpacking to do. Um, silicone lady lampent. Litwick, Oddish, Love Disc, Tynamo, C Dot, Stone Joiner, Reverse, and we have the Garatina V. Look at that artwork right there. That looks phenomenal. Just look at the texture of it. It just, the card is popping. Wow. That is nice. Nice right there. I mean, you can't go wrong with that nearly a ten dollar card so we're doing good here we have a few few cards here that are more than five dollars which is great we have the pikachu card um pikachu v at almost 25 dollars it's nice that we got that hopefully we can get another another hit or two damage pump dotler mean foo litwick snover rhyhorn apalm Electrike Mal Amar. Alamar. Right, these booster this booster box is gonna fall over with the cards and just make a mess, hit the camera. 
we don't want to do all of that let's just keep the booster box the booster packs out of the booster box for now So if you were able to go to a local comic book shop to pick these up this week, they were doing a lot a little back to school promo that I guess Pokemon did where they gave uh, retailers um, a bunch of little goodies to bring, uh, you know, to give to kids for school. We have a man man centric um, and they were like a pencil, a bookmark, a magnet, a book cover. And it was all lost origin it was pretty cool to get that in the little bag i mean i'm saving most of this stuff for my son but let's check out the artwork i know it's almost the end of the video here um but i figured let me just at least show the artwork at least before it's done because we don't have too many packs left so um let's try to get some more hits we have a lot of hits so far we have a bunch of v cards here um the garatina v just just look at it there just it just pops out just a great great looking card really excited about that card probably the best so now we're doing the speed round so we have the paris and we have the beauty fly beauty fly is not a really um expensive card but that's okay um as i said i'm listing the prices here just to give everyone an idea um of what to look for if you do unpack some of these but definitely go check out um tcg player and you'll get a better understanding of how much everything is worth and you'll see how much other people are selling it for um, but don't just limit yourself there there's troll and toad um vectors cache also sells stuff two singles and we have a uh, hans crow non-hollow um you can check out ebay as i said um i'm not sure if facebook market i know some people sell things there i'm not sure i would really trust it so much but I bought a lot of stuff from eBay and I trust it. If you pay attention to the rating, I mean, I really care about my eBay rating and there's people out there that really do take it seriously. So, um, you, it's always good there. Let's see what the pull card is. Uh, Zorark V star big hit $12 card. We got two V stars. That's great. But this is so much better right here. Just look at that. Zoro arc V star nice 12 dollar hit with the garatina v the pikachu v look at that right there just that's great right there you have nearly a 50 dollar value in three cards ungraded graded everything changes a few more packs left let's check this out seal oh let's go roserade character character card and we have a mr mime i never really know how to count all these cards i guess character cards trainer cards I guess trainer trainer gallery cards um those are pretty cool but the pikachu v is by far the top one by far like well the v max would be better than that but that's Today, out of today, that's definitely the big hit of the day. We have Jinx, Sub Wudu Reverse, and we have a Dugon Non Hollow. I have just a few more packs to go. Hopefully, we can get a little bit of magic out of these last ones. Maybe we might just get that Garatina uh, full art that we saw earlier in the video. A wonderful looking card. Shuppet. Nuzleaf. And uh, Area Dose. Non hollow. And everything clean. Now you gotta do things. Keep your workstation clean. Finian. Chandelure. Non reverse and the hollow. Nice. Okay. Probably about 25 cents. Not bad. 
Now, something I haven't mentioned here, if you're trying to sell lots, because this is usually where I get the idea for all of this stuff. So if you look at any of my lots, everything is based upon this price. And you may wonder, how do you equate the uh, commons? Those commons and uncommons are five cents each. Pidgeot V. Wonderful. I know there's some reverses that may be 10, 15 cents. They're five cents in my world. Um, and again, the, the hope that I have is that I help you complete your collection at an affordable price and also that you have the opportunity to maybe make a few bucks down the road with some of these cards. The community and we have to share together, you know? Shilos, Ruck Ruff, Reverse, and a Comfy Non Hollow. We have two packs left. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. We catch a tiger by a toe. We're doing this one. <laughs> I do like the quick unpack. If I ever do a major, like, 100 booster packs, I'm definitely going to do the quick unpack. Oh, we have the Kingdra. Nice. Reverse. Completes the evolution. And a Mimikyu. Nice. My second favorite uh, Pokemon there. I just really like uh, the, the the dark Halloween stuff. I love the Halloween theme. Um, hopefully, I can get my hands on some trick or trade Halloween promos so we can open up that and check it out together. But um, since this is the last pack, uh, thank you all for watching. Um, it's been fun. And the final card of the unpacking is a uh, Mag Cargo. All right, so that was a pretty cool unpacking there. We had a lot of really cool cards. I cannot complain. We have the Radiant card, which is pretty cool. Um, really happy about that. And then, of course, the Pikachu V. Just an, an amazing card. I'm really going to uh, enjoy opening up more of Lost Origin. Um, fortunately, I'm a little disappointed in the non hollow rares. Looks like about half of the booster box were these. So um not very good at all i'm not very happy there but hopefully um this was just a one-off type of box and things will change and um you know things will be a little bit better in my pull rates so thank you for tuning in please do like and subscribe and do comment um if you click the little notification bell you'll get a notification um a video which is usually on wednesdays Occasionally on Saturdays, they do fun during the week at random any given time. I do love unpacking stuff, so definitely do check out more of my videos. And yeah, it's been real. See you guys. Have fun. Take care. Safe.